Hi, I'm Shelly LeVette with ChildCareLand.com and today I want to share with you letter clothespins. I had a question asked um, after I did a recent video on uh, fine motor skills using clothespins and pinching them around um, the edge of a bowl. I had mentioned that you could use, also put letters on them. Somebody asked me if I could show an example of that. All you would need are the wood clothespins and you can either hand write them on, and, but because I'm left-handed and my handwriting is not the greatest, I choose to put stickers on. And for that, I just went to a craft store and I went to the, the scrapbooking section and they have all kinds of um, stickers, letters, alphabet stickers on there. You wanna be careful the type of font that you use. You want it to be something clear that children will easily be able to read. And of course you wanna, maybe you should just take a clothespin with you, um, which is what I did to find size a size of stickers that would fit onto the bottom of the clothespin. And after that, it was, the rest of it is easy. You just put the stickers onto the clothespin and then I gave it a layer, a couple layers of Mod Podge, which I like to use to, uh, to seal everything. It's not like an acrylic sealer or anything, but it's gonna help protect the stickers on your clothespins. And then what we do with these clothespins is we put them on clotheslines in alphabetical order. We put them around bowls, which I, we already did a video of that. And we use them for matching activities, which my next video um, that you'll be seeing shortly um, will be about using them with matching cards or letter cards. So I just wanted to give you a brief explanation of the uh, letter clothespins. And for that, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com, and thanks for watching.